Hello, hello, and welcome to Coffee Craft. I am your host, Anon Jr., and I hope I'm standing under the cobblestone. Let me just back up a smidge, because uh, it is day <laughs> however many. Uh, actually, I think on the uh, on the F3 screen, there is supposed to be... Yeah, it is Minecraft Day 2510, and I have still not yet slept. Sorry, 2511. Thank you, Arcadius. Uh, <clears throat> I, I really do need to get a bed so that way I can uh, not have the phantoms arrive. Um, all right, let me... Let's see, what do I want to do? Um, I'd love to show you all the changes that happen, but other than a couple of minor bits of resource gathering, not much has changed. I... I was originally trying to find a spot to build a particular mob farm. And I couldn't find a spot that... Well, first, I couldn't find the plans for the farm that I wanted to build, uh, which was frustrating. And then I looked at a couple of variants of my second choice for farm, and I found all of them more than moderately frustrating and unsatisfying. So, what I'm thinking about doing is retooling the slime farm. I think, and I'm not 100% sure I can pull this off, but I think if I do this right, I can set it up so that uh, I can build a mob farm 40 blocks up. So that way the spawning chambers are above the slime farm, where the slimes would normally spawn. And using that, I could double up on, on the farm. Like, like, so in other words, I could get mobs to spawn in the mob part, drop down into the slime collection area. Uh, and maybe even flush the slimes to the killing chamber quicker. Uh, I also need to figure out a way to, to be able to shut off the slime farm and make sure that I have a way to shut off the uh, the the mob farm itself. But we'll, we'll we'll get to we'll get to that kind of planning in a little bit because I also need I need to do some resource gathering. I need more iron. Um, and now is a good time as any to build un... over there. Over there. Over oh. there. Where? Right there. What right there? Your build. Hmm. Uh huh. What? There's the uh, there's the village, or the village, the villager motel. But, yep, this is, uh, that's what it looks like with the shaders on during the day. And I'm going to do something that I don't like doing. Let me, let me do that so that way I don't, uh, mess with Medic Stream. Um, <clears throat> so, part of what I want to do is I want to get the resource gathering done. We updated the cobblestone generator. And now is as good as time as any to, to... Well, I got time for yakety yak type stuff. Uh, sorry, gotta remember where all my buttons are. There we go. So this is version two of our ore generation statistics. So at, at the beginner level, you're, you're still 100% cobblestone. So anywhere from island level zero, which you technically can't have, up to island level 19, you're getting nothing but cobblestone. Uh, at 20, you, you're you're moving up a little bit. Pretty much the, the, the main ones we changed is we changed the iron ore to bump that up a little bit. We changed the coal ore to bump that one up a little bit. And, and that's that's it so far on that front. Because our, our main goal for the cobblestone generator was to set it up such that uh, 
a session with the cobble generator would get you plus or minus uh, something reasonably close to what a similar mining session would get you in vanilla Minecraft. And we were finding the coal and iron sorely lacking. Uh, the lapis and gold feels just a smidge slim, but looking at the statistics and then going back and looking at some of the stuff we did, yeah, that they probably are about as slim as they're supposed to be. So that is it for the ore generation. And if if you saw Arcadius or Exmetic Frog stream earlier, you'll notice that some changes were made to the Nether. I have no fancy graph because it's really hard to explain. So this is literally a uh, screenshot of the code for the configuration settings. Um, so. Probability of forming blocks. That means that when you break the block in blue, the P is the percentage chance of getting whatever the next thing is. So when you break netherrack, you get a 30% chance to get another netherrack. And you get a 15% chance for an additional one beyond that. You get a 5% chance to get some nether quartz or 5% chance to get some nether gold or 5% uh, chance for soul sand, 5% chance for soul soil. 5% chance for a magma block, 5% chance for crimson nihilium, 5% for warp nihilium, and we scaled the ancient debris back to 3%, because uh, that, that was feeling like it was a little bit a little bit heavier than normal. Likewise, if you break another quartz ore, you got a 30% chance to get another one. You got a 10% chance to uh, to get a an additional one beyond that. Hey, medic. Thank you, thank you. Let me, uh, let me, let me turn the, uh, un re, re unmute myself. Oh, come on. Why are you doing this to, to me, Discord? There we go. Discord was not cooperating. Thank you for the raid. Uh, you are welcome. I was going over the changes that we made to to the ore generation and I've got up on my screen right now the the changes to the nether generation uh, a lot of this is stuff that, that we have added that's not in the vanilla skyblock uh, like th there was very sm the only chance you got of getting another nether quartz ore in the original skyblock it is uh, hey intent to thrill thank you I, I didn't realize that you hadn't uh, hadn't followed before now Let me get the alert box. Uh, I didn't realize that that had been buried under everything else. Okay. Uh, so, and there was no option for nether gold ore, so I, I added that back in after our meeting. Same for magma blocks and soul sand and soul soil. Uh, so when, when you look at that, it, it's... When you break the block in blue, you've got that percentage chance to get the next... the other thing. Uh, I haven't had a chance to talk to the talk to the the server yet and find out ex whether that dialed it up too much, not enough, where things sat with that. Uh, but we'll, we'll we'll see how that goes. All right, let me get back to back to the main show. Okay. Um, I'm hoping that this means that I can start using iron picks for my cobble sessions and get enough iron back to replace the pick plus maybe one or two more because that that's about what a, a, a regular you know caving session would get me is enough to replace the pick with a couple little iron extra after that so that's the hope but what I what I need because what I need is what I'm thinking of doing. All right, now let's start talking plans. Yes, waterlogged half slabs will stop your fall, and you don't have to swim out of them. Uh, matter of fact, a waterlogged chest will stop your fall momentum, and you have even less to wade out of. So right now in in here, I've got a little four uh, two by two chamber with uh, 
with some campfires and it's a three by three space so the big guys can fit in there and because slimes are dumb they'll just bounce around until they die in the fire what I'm thinking of doing is actually bumping this up to a full-on 3x3 grid of hoppers and maybe getting two sets of three chests. So that would be 12 hoppers in total, which is a lot more than I wanted to dedicate to one farm. But again, I want to remodel the back of the farm here so there's a flushing mechanism. So instead of waiting for them to eventually bounce their way off the platform, uh, set up a clock that will uh, flush flush them to the front and off to the sides and get them off the platform quicker than they are right now. And once that's in place, build a mob farm uh, where the spawning platforms are above Y40 and then just dump them all Hang on. Okay. Um, and, and, and just uh, have the regular mob, the regular mob farm, dump into the uh, yeah, dump into the the storage for this. Uh, and given the odd shape, I may not be able to do this quite as elegantly as I had wanted to. But maybe I will. We'll see. Because uh, what I might just do is I might have the killing platform just a little bit higher up and then flush that off. So the only thing i got to worry about uh, flushing into here are the items. It's a thought. I don't know if it's a good thought, but it's a thought. But in order to do that, I need I need blocks. I need fence gates. I need uh, trap doors because I don't have dispensers right now. But the next best thing to dispensers is uh, waterlogged trap doors because you can still manipulate those with a redstone signal and um, they, they work about as well. All right, so let's get back to home. Because I know that my little melon farm is pitiful. Uh, I'll get a bigger one in place as soon as I as soon as I can uh, move things forward on the resource front. Same with uh, same with this poor guy here. Uh, I did realize why the water wasn't flowing the way I thought it did, and it's twofold. Every design that I've seen that has the sand at the same level has the hole in the middle of the farm for capturing the cacti. And I really needed to make it bigger. So instead of uh, two, three, four, five, six, seven, I needed to make it nine and then put the water in each corner. And it would flush it all to the center. And I may, I may do that uh, down, down below in a minute. You, you can, you can ask over voice. <laughs> it worked just as well, and I didn't want to interrupt you. Oh, uh, let's see. That's the case. sapling I got oh no I got a little more than one sapling good all right let me uh let me harvest these logs real quick oh I forgot to put up another um spruce that that has been my primary source of lumber because uh you can get a lot of spruce in a hurry if you need to
And I like the look of the acacia for some of the stuff, but I absolutely hate harvesting it. <laughs> Feel like you're playing parkour? Ah, uh, that too, yeah. So uh you tell me how how does the uh how does the new nether generation algorithm seem like we're getting too much too little about closer to what we were trying for I feel after a few sessions today I feel like it might be goosed a little too much okay uh Bear in mind that by using a netherite pick like you do, you are multiplying your results. Oh, well, well then maybe not. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the tool you use has an impact on just what kind of results you get. Yeah, Medic was telling me that the other day. I didn't realize that was an issue. Or is that just Skyblock? Uh, that's just Skyblock. Oh, okay. So I, I shouldn't expect this kind of stuff in vanilla. No. <laughs> Darn. No. I was getting happy. <laughs> I was like, really? Well, I mean, just... it it matters in the sense that it's uh, easier or harder to break, and fortune matters in the sense that, uh, you know, you'll get you'll get more with a fortune tool than you will with you know a normal one, but not not in the sense that like you're gonna get. In, in vanilla nether blocks don't magically appear because you broke another block <laughs> this is true I already knew that though Ugh, goodness gracious why do I give myself these crazy tasks what you trying to do right now make a village <laughs> well when two villagers love each other very much they populate a village. Not that kind of village. <laughs> Not that kind of village. No. Oh, I, I almost forgot. Uh, Medic, you were trying to figure out why the golems were spawning, even though there was no uh, critter there to scare them. Scaring them is only one of the one of two possible reasons why a golem will spawn in a village. It's most often used in iron farms because it's the easiest to manipulate. But if enough gossip is shared between enough villagers, they will spawn in an iron golem. That's why our trading hall in season one had an iron golem in there. Because of all the gossip between the villagers in the trading hall. That suddenly makes a lot more sense. Now. Yeah. Yeah, I couldn't figure it out either because the only mechanic... I, 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 For some reason, I thought they had removed the gossip. And what it was is they had decoupled it. Because during the early testing for 1.16 or 15, I can't remember. No, 1.15. Maybe? Yeah, 15. Uh, whenever it was that they overhauled that, Originally, in a lot of the snapshots, it was a combination of gossip and how scared they were that would cause an iron golem to spawn. And then eventually they got to the point where they, they changed it so that way it was either gossip or getting scared. And that that was that was the uh I, I missed that it was either or because all the iron farms use scaring the ever loving snot out of them to, to spawn a golem. Um, because that's the easiest to manipulate. Okay. But that also means that you should keep an eye on your village people because they will, uh, they will, they will spawn the golems unless you spawn proof the area. So you can set it up such that um, no golem has space to spawn. Yeah, but doing that just ruins the aesthetics most of the time. Uh, like as it is now, I can't 
I'm having the hardest time lighting this build in such a way that I don't destroy. You I was know, the expecting way it a looks. little more, right? that, but okay. Um. Yeah. Well, it's not just lighting, because golems don't care about light level. Um, you would need to put like buttons on the floor, or I think half slabs would also work. Uh, bottom slabs. Um. Uh, now I'm drawing a blank because I, I know that the it, it's a little more complicated than a normal that than normal mob proofing because light level doesn't matter and there's a few other things that normally would matter that don't. Okay, yeah, I might work on that too. What I'm looking for. All right, I got a bunch of these. I'll need where my bucket of water go. Let me sit downstairs. Here's my bucket, and I forgot about making trap doors. I'll I'll use what I got down here. All right. Um, how many trap doors do I need? That is a question worth answering. I'll borrow these real quick. what I want to do is I want to put a clock on the side here I also want to get a little lava blade across there so the big guys start taking damage while they're backing up so what I want to do is I want to get rid of that water channel in the back. And that is where my redstone will go. And the flushing mechanism. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Mm. I was a little worried about that. Because then the water is only going to push them out to the last block, but not all the way off. I could do a split level platform, though. Just do that one block higher. Because so I don't think I'm going to need more than two rows for two of those three. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to need more than two of those three rows. I almost want to shrink those down so those are evenly sized too, but that's that's not going to help anything. Uh, hmm. What I need to do is take this pocket full of slabs and, <laughs> and cover that up so nothing spawns while I'm trying to plan this out. That might be my next step right there. Get this set up so that way... Uh, it, the farm is effectively turned off while I try to figure out what I'm doing. Because I do not need to be dodging slimes while I'm trying to figure this out. Uh, matter of fact, let's take... What else do I need before I get in there? I don't know. I'll figure it out. All right. That's the bottom. That's the bottom. That's the bottom.
Hello, friend. No. Go away. Nobody wants you. Nobody likes you. That's not true. You're hurting its feelings. No wonder it wants to jump on you. <laughs> Everybody loves a slime. Uh huh. Sure. They're cuddly and squishy, and they squeak like a jubba toy. And hi, friend. slabs with me. <sighs> Poor planning strikes again. Oh yeah, I didn't even bring closer to enough. All right, well, let me at least turn this platform off. At least they can't get back up here and, and start into me with their nudge of death. <laughs> right. I'll leave that clear because what I want to do is I still want to keep that side channel to to help get them off the platform as much as I'd love to have three more blocks worth of spawning space I don't want to have to raise those walls too much more and I really want more places to push them off and into the stream Hi, friend. <laughs> Go somewhere else. That's just not going to work for you. <laughs> you don't think so? No, no, I, I don't think that's going to help you. I mean, it was worth a try. Yeah, yeah, you know, props for the uh, the effort. <sighs> Guys, seriously, you're in my way. I just need you a little bit shorter. Tell you what, as soon as I get a honey farm together, I'm about ready to replace this with uh, honey blocks to keep them from jumping as much. I wonder if you can push them along laterally on uh, honey blocks. I know there's a lot you can do with the, the vertical, but I, I don't know if you can do as much laterally. That might, uh, that might bear some experimentation. Okay. So the whole point of the fence gates is once I lift up the slabs, they will they will allow the water to flow up to the fence gates, but not through it. And the mobs will uh, be able to move through them. But, uh... Hello, Pinky. The mobs will be able to move through them, 
but uh but not the water Need to get the caffeinate reminder soon. <laughs> At least I made some coffee. At least I actually have it with me. All right, uh, that's probably not enough. I actually wonder if that's gonna be enough. Oh yeah, that should be enough. Okay, okay. Uh, that should be enough fence gates for now. <laughs> so I get for walking away. They're back again. Although that's not bad for just a couple of minutes. Go away. Oh, you can make that jump. Oh, my, uh, you guys are too tall to get through there. How about now? Can you fit through? Can you fit through there now? Let's try to get this uh, slabbed over, and that'll turn these two spawning platforms off, and I can get to retrofitting. I might also have to raise this platform up. I don't know. We shall see. slimes are getting in. Let me go elsewhere. No, no. Let me get this uh, squared away first. I'm still waiting for a phantom to come out of the air and uh, ruin my day. I'm not playing those games. Uh, apparently not mathing correctly today either. I know, I know, not just today. These guys. These guys. Alright. The whole point of having this platform at two blocks up is that prevents them from jumping back up on the platform and uh, gets them to the killing area faster. So that way we can uh, harvest the slime quicker. The sooner they get to the killing area, the sooner they die, the sooner they free up the mob cap, and the less trouble you have to worry about. I mean, unless Arcadius doesn't light up his garden, then there, there's no helping the mob cap. Fair warning, I'm not lighting up my garden, so... Oh. Uh. <laughs> Do you usually light up your garden? You nope. should. There, there's no way. 
<laughs> You'd have to see what I've done to, to realize. I, I did no see some of what you did. Uh, I noticed where all your uh, mycelium went to. Oh no, that got ripped up. You again? You seen anything? Yeah, no, I I can't make up my mind. I th I'm happy with it now, though. But you are you? Seen the For now. Product. Yeah, I'm good now. You, you are. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You yeah. sure? Mm -hmm. I've already moved on to like two other projects. Mm-hmm. 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 Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Th this is the voice of belief. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know. So I want to keep the side channels open to give them three... Your base three... has channels? Oh, I mean, most bases... Can you swim across them? Most, most bases just need a channel. Assuming the sound guy even bothers to put them in the mix. Hmm. Not all bases are necessary. I I do like that uh the Babylon B had a wonderful article, the new church base, church choir base. It has five frets and two strings. That's cute. <laughs> I feel like I'm still a little uh music related uh stressed out. Yeah. I get that. I do. You know what I forgot to do? I forgot to count how many, uh, how many stupid... You forgot to count the stupid? I'm sorry. <laughs> There's no counting the stupid. No, I forgot to count how say, many... Have you been outside? <laughs> well, I don't know. I forgot to count how many, uh, trapdoors I need. Ooh, all my stuffies are back. Which stuff? My fruits and vegetables and things. Alright, so I'm gonna need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, twelve. Duck on it. There's a reason why I left that there. trapdoors and then a bunch of other stuff you see that I modified my hallway a little no I didn't okay does your staircase now connect to the top yep sort of I mean it's just like one sh thin strip like it's not done here I'll take a quick peek Hi, um, I love your ink collection. Oh. <laughs> Told you I had a lot of ink. That's just from making the tower. Uh, no, it, it was the all the ink that was sitting on the floor as I walked by. Oh, oops. Weren't, weren't you getting on somebody about safety rails? Well, that platform's not staying there. Like, I was very cavalier about... Not a forever platform. Well, it's taking forever to get up the platform. Oh, you're talking about my stairs? Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's, they're going to be multiple wide down the road. Okay. But I got to finish harvesting. 
Oh. And then they will have rails when I'm done harvesting or done making the multiple wide and all that. Gotcha. Well, I don't know why I'm wor worried about falling to my death. I'm on your island. Guests can't die from fall damage. Although, I don't know that, that platform's big enough to catch me. Nope, but the void can eat you. Uh-huh. Oh. Day 78. <laughs> Top of the platform is in sight. I still, I see you still have a few uh, spots for friends to stop by. Where? Some of the cobble columns? Or are they lit up enough oh. by the adjacent torch? They're lit up enough by the adjacent torch for now, but that is a work in progress. Ah. All right, where am I supposed to be going? To the top top? Yeah, to the very top. Yeah, for a second there, I was trying to figure out why you had 15, not IS. <laughs> oh. Something going here where the, where the water is? I don't know yet. Okay. As long as you don't know Thoughts. either. Thoughts are going there. Like your uh, concentric sugar cane. Isn't it pretty? Are you going to do a second one just like it next to it? or? Mm hmm yep. I was going to say, because you're, you're going to need more sugar cane than that. Oh, no, there's going to be one across the way. Cool. Like over there. Oh. Of all of this. oh, are you going to mirror what you have here on the other mm -hmm. side there? Yep. Gotcha. Nice. Thank you. That is a lot of chiseled stone. <laughs> how much... How much Cold? Did you burn through to get all that chiseled stone? I don't know. Some trees. It's just trees. <laughs> I I mean, I guess yes. Technically, coal does grow on trees. Literally, not even figuratively. No, oh, I mean, almost literally. Also, did you see that it perfectly lines up? Where all these pillars are the width of a farm, and it goes all the way to the edge. I did. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. My heart is happy. No one's in pumpkins and slabs, so am I. Alright, I need... How do you do the fence thingy with the quest thingy? Uh, I need more words than thingies. <sighs> I want my box to tell me about the quest. Then... And then when I have all the things to tell me how much of the thing I need to do my next version of the quest. Put, put the sign on the chest. Your first line is left square bracket. Wait, hang on. Let, let, you know. Um, oh. Let me go back to uh, spawn. A non junior I, I, is. A non junior is. Hush. Okay, there is no slash. So. USB in square brackets, and the next line is the start of the name of the challenge. We'll get you the sign below, just like what I'm looking at right now. And I think what I need to do is I'll put together a cheat sheet 
of mm-hmm. the names that you'd need for the signs because not all of them are as obvious as you would think or as you would like to hope. You said the thing in front of you. Well, I was just there. I was there for an extended time. You're not helpful. I need to know the name of the challenge. Mm-hmm. Okay, so if I want to do the wheat one, it's called Wheat Farmer. Yeah, but you don't even have to put the full name. Like, you could just put Wheat, and it should find the challenge. All right, and I do what? Left square bracket. Left square bracket. Okay. Oh, no, it's not square. Square, okay. It needs to be more square here. USB. Right square bracket. Okay. And then on the next line, the start of the name of the challenge. Just enough to differentiate it from any other challenge that might be starting with those letters. Wheat farmer. Harvest a wheat from a farm. So then That's it would it be says. slash... Then, then it would just be wheat. Not enough items in chest to complete challenge. Okay. Need 80 wheat. Okay. Did, did you get what you needed? Is it giving you how much? No, it's not telling me how much, but it is working where it's like telling me like nay nay good friend huh it's telling me I don't have enough stuff for the challenge but it's not telling me how much I need to do the challenge I don't that it, I don't know that it'll actually tell you that how much you need it yeah. just tells you if the test has what it needs yeah see trigger farmer Harvest from a farm. I need four more sugar I don't know game. why you keep saying C. Hello, You're not Beach standing Duck. next to me. So, in that sense, yes, Hold it on. should give you the number remaining in red. Like, that means I need 23 more cactus. Cacti. Mine is not looking like yours. Uh... Well, it's nighttime. I can't venture out over there without being assaulted. I don't know what you're talking about. Nobody's out here. Uh, not yet. It is case sensitive and the challenges are in lowercase. My challenges are not in lowercase. Yes, they are. Mind the first letters are capitalized. N- not the display name, the challenge name. How do I know what the challenge name is? So, like, you've got Adept Builder, Animal Farm. That So what's the wheat one called? So it is called uh, Wheat Farmer, but it is one word, all lowercase. And you don't need to type like in the this. whole thing, just enough to differentiate it from Wither Hunter and Wool Collector. So, slash challenges, info. We'll let you that. We'll give you autocomplete. We'll give you the list of other challenges and what they're called. Ah, there we go. You got it? Yep, now it works. Yay, sleeping. (laughs) Is the melon one called Melon Farmer? Yes. Yeah. Although, honestly, if you just put melon, it's the only one that starts with melon. The only one that's but a little less... my inner le- completionist. Yeah, but it's going to change it for you anyway. All you're doing is giving it enough to look it up. 
Are, are you arguing with completionist values? In this case, yeah, actually. Oh, because they're not your completionist values. No. It makes me feel good to type it all. Yeah, but Ooh, the more letters already. The more letters you type, the more opportunity there is to mistype something. Which means the more opportunity for me to learn to be accurate on the names of these things. Mm-hmm. 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 So we goose the iron rates, and that's two stone picks where I've gotten no iron. Because, of course. Not like we goosed them a ton. No, I know we didn't goose them a ton, but still. Alright, um. What was I looking for? I was looking for something. Oh. I need. Some redstone dust. Uh, I'm probably going to need some sticks, so we'll have plenty of that. I need water. I need help. I guess I technically don't need to line the entire wall of that either. Because uh, if I were to... If I were king of the jungle. Oh, king of the forest, that's what it was. Yeah. side up. I'll need... Actually... No, other way. I always struggle with that. Which way to put the trapdoors down to get what you're looking for. There we go. fence gates that I just put away. Because <laughs> of course I will. And we'll go like so, like so. Oh, the floor's not blue, that's water. I was using that to push the slimes around the corner to their eventual and sudden demise. Okay, not so sudden. Water's slow. No, I wish I had ice, but uh... <laughs> I, I gotta get a few more things together first. Once I can start changing the biomes to the uh, the chillier biomes, then it very it will be very cool. Not that kind of cool though, but. things that it's not going to create infinite water sources up here with the water log trap doors, is it? Oh, it will. Oh, that's just wonderful. Okay. Um, sweet. That 
that just made life a lot easier. Now get the ends as soon as I... Uh, you know what? Let's go like a so. Like a so, like a so, like a so. No. Because that's really all I need to do. Yeah. Yeah, I can make that work. I'll have to build up this back wall a little bit more, but I can make that work. Then we'll go like a so. turns on that's going to start flowing out except that'll go down and then we'll get another elevation change here which should keep the water flowing stuff like get a couple more jack-o'-lanterns and hope I can get this guy up without losing them that way I can put him right there I'll put that right there for now put that right there for now wall set up so the slimes don't jump over them yeah okay let me grab some different lumber <laughs> that's what I wanted to do okay good I think what I might do is leave the stone base and then put uh, a wooden wooden wall higher up. Uh, I came here for a reason. What did I come here for? Came here for a reason. To get things, to make things. Yeah, I just don't remember what it was. Oh. My poor brain. I have very few farms right now, unfortunately. I haven't been able to do too much uh, outside of the few hours that I live stream. I was kind of hoping to get a little bit more, more than that, but time and life and such. How many farms do I need? I need all the farms. All of them. Need? Need. Okay. Mm-hmm. I need to be king of the farms.
If I were king of the farms. Because if I were king... No, I won't do that to you. Yeah, most of those areas are me just marking off where the slime chunks are, so that way I'm a little more careful of what I build over them. Because uh, I don't want unintended side effects to come jumping around my farm. This thing was a little, eh. I was getting ready to say this thing was a waste of time, but maybe not. Yes, this is a family-friendly station. guys. Hmm. Hmm. So, well, let's see. So if I get a repeater there, that means that's going to be at 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, Seven, six, five, four. And then I get hit another repeater and another one before I get started on the next run. Which, which should absolutely work. All right. Uh, so that means I need something that's going to. I think. I think any block that I put over there is going to. Power it. Like if I, even if I just put uh, regular wooden blocks and uh, get some dust. So as long as I power the block underneath. No. 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 Uh. Oh, because <laughs> uh, it's the opposite. Okay, while that's powered, it's up. While that is unpowered, that's down. Because of course it is. Because of course it is. Why? Why should it be simple? Just need that to make sure nothing spawns on there while I'm uh, working on this next little bit. Because once I get I don't need uh, I don't need the water from down there anymore. water source? That's my last water source. That's just my way back up. Um, 
Did Medic fail to eat? I suspect so. He did. Okay. He'll be back with us momentarily. Uh, that's counterproductive. Um, bother. Oh, bother. All right, I'll grab that part last. Um, that is going to go out in there, isn't it? That's going to cut off some of the space in my middle channel. Only a little bit. It shouldn't be a problem. Maybe. Hopefully. Possibly. Alright. So... more smooth stuff. But I can tear a lot of this out because I don't need this stone here anymore. Matter of fact, this is my chance to fix uh, a lot of that stuff there too. Hey, hon. I come bearing presents. I like uh -oh. presents. It's a puffer fish present. It's a poofer I, fish. I don't want that present. That's not a present. <laughs> Is it a poofer fish? That's that's negative presents. <laughs> I mean, it has a presence. Or are you looking for presents? Oh no, don't throw it to me here. I have nowhere to put it here. And you can't pick it back up, can you? Oh, you can? Yeah, because I'm the one that dropped it. Go down here to do that. Exchange. Do you see my new top of everything? Hmm? Everything has a different top design. Did I get it all? Sweet. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Okay. Can uh, you make sure that I got it all? Yeah, I was going to go look before I teleported away. Okay. Did you want to look around at the new stuff I did? I saw on uh, a non-stream. How do you like the new entryway? It looks nice. I like it. I like making it a little bit taller. I think it makes it look fancier. 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 <laughs> okay. Uh, you know what? Sometimes we all just want to be a little bit fancy. Oh, do you fancy that? I do. That's why I said it. Fonzie would approve. Although, <laughs> it's funny you bring up the pronunciation. There was a fun little discussion on that on Monday's Daily Tech News show. Because uh, Rich, for whatever reason, decided to speak of a controversy. And uh, that, that got into details and details and all sorts of other pronunciation and enunciation fun. Gets me some of those guys. I need at least two, four, no, three. Ah, won't hurt to have more anyway. Yeah. I want 
some dark oak planks, some spruce planks. I'm gonna want... some... spruce slabs. Some dark oak slabs. Hun, are you somewhere to commit to sleeping? It's not time it's, yet. It's time. Okay, because I could use that. I think we could all use some sleep. Because I am hanging oh, in precarious in the game. places. in the game. Thank you. As I'm always, sleeping. you're very welcome to help, sleep in sir. Cup, so. I try. I try to be as much help as I possibly what? can. I said I have sleep in a cup. Oh, seriously? Coffee. There, there's coffee. <laughs> Not the same. Stupid co Holy mother of God, Batman. You get one little bit of water. Is this about to be a mm -hmm. fish farm on top of a mob farm? <laughs> I mean... <laughs> That sounds like a personal issue. So, is that where? Yes, because I want the jack o' lanterns to be the last. We'll go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, yeah. So the jack-o'-lanterns are where I want my last little bit of that level. And then I can put uh, the top slabs at the jack-o'-lanterns old level. And that's pretty much going to be from there on out. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Okay. Maybe. I don't know. Is it okay? Is anything okay? What is the meaning of okay? What is the meaning of life? Fine. Hmm? Everything's fine. <laughs> it's all fine. That's fine. Yeah. All I can hear is zombie Cleo now. That's fine. It's okay. And by the way, they were sold out by the time I tried to buy that thing, and I am really sad about it. Which one? The zombie Cleo plushie? plushie? No. What? The It's Fine Dumpster Fire. Oh. Oh, yeah. Uh, I still want to go I still want to go over to the Modern Rogue Shop and buy some of that stuff, just because of the... Some people because are being people jerks. Are yeah. Because people. They have little doggy bandanas with modern rogue on them. Oh, that's cute. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's very special. Uh... <laughs> They, they, they have uh, insulated wine cups. That's necessary. Mm hmm Does that mean we could get some for Beach Duck? Uh, that, that's why I was uh, saying it the way I did. I feel like anyone who knows Beach Duck knows that she likes a good insulated mug. Mm -hmm. uh, wine in it. As much as I would love to make that joke at her, not. Nah, I get it. Like it's just a good insulated mug. Mm -hmm. Like there's something about a good cup. Yeah. That makes the soul very happy. Oh, well, depending on what it's insulating. For the most part, no. For me, just just a good cup. 
Now, that being said, a sad cup is made all that much more sadder by having sad things in it or by just being a sad cup. Um, okay, so for this row, I do want blocks. This row, I should be okay with top slabs. And for this row, I should be okay with top slabs. And this row, I don't want to mess with the back row because that's where, that's where, um, the trapdoors are. <sighs> My kingdom for some uh, boots of depths riding. What you got to trade? Nah, I'm not trading anything this season. <laughs> Remember, I'm trying to build this no island. No people, no kindness, no I'm nothing. I'm trying to do whatever. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out what I can do on my own. That uh, trading's not on my own. Okay, okay, okay. I'll just throw these boots somewhere. Uh... Okay. Teasing. I'm teasing. Throw them okay. somewhere. Oh, well, back in this box. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Help, 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 uh, help, 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 help. Oh, I can't help you with that. Nobody can. It's your island. Your island, your problem. What happened, or why, or how? It's not even dark. How did. I don't know. Uh. You have a dark spot somewhere. Yeah. Well, come help me find it. Can't help you. You can do the the Cody thingy look aroundy. The Cody thingy look around. What? Words <laughs> happened. Words definitely happened. I'll, I'll grant you that. <laughs> I, d I don't even know. Oh. You don't even know what words happened? Yeah, that makes two of us. Yeah, I'm confused. And yet you both knew what I meant. No, yet we didn't. <laughs> no, not really. Not this time. Sometimes. Sometimes, <gasps> but not this you time. Push the buttons that makes it where you can see what's happening. F3? And what levels things are. Yeah, that. You want me to come F3 your entire island? <laughs> Yes, please. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> she will gladly pay you Tuesday for some F3 today. Uh, I've already prepaid him a lot in materials. Thank you very much. Whoa, 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 whoa. I appreciate the clay, but I've given you a double chest full of stone. Uh -oh. Not cobblestone, but... Are, are, are we about to get the audience to weigh in on who has paid whom... And to what is owed? There was no paying. There's no owing. I'm just saying. You can't be throwing clay in my face right now. <laughs> well, I mean. Oh my goodness. She's not exactly throwing it in your face. You that was place. how you got the clay. Well, she threw it at your face. Stupid water mechanics. 
So anyway. <laughs> so is that the controversy? Is uh. Help, please. But it wasn't even nighttime. It doesn't have to be if the area is not properly spawn proofed. There's the rest of my bricks. Oh, those fence gates should have been one block higher. That's what the problem is. Okay. Where'd Medic go? <laughs> to eat dinner, I think. When's he coming back? After <laughs> dinner? After... <laughs> Beat me to it. Sorry. <laughs> Some people are nicer to me. Oh, jeez. Uh. Really? really? No, come back! <laughs> Actually, I need to... Uh... What do I need to do? I need to do a lot of things. I need to make some more dark oak fence gates. flow over? How is that going to keep flowing over? Oh, good. I wonder if uh... that changes things. Alright, water. Work with me here. It doesn't want to. No, it doesn't want to. Also, I still need to do upside down mossy stairs under all my existing stairs to make them look a little thicker. <laughs> you, you're killing me with all the I'm mossy stuff. I... It's pretty. Mm -hmm. And it lets me know the things pretty. that don't need to be touched. It's pretty and functional. is pretty functional. I'll give you that. 
fuck far out does water hydrate? Uh, I can never remember. I want to say it's eight blocks. I'm like 80% sure that that's the case. You're 80% sure that it's eight? Mm-hmm. Ah, you... <sighs> Stupid water. I wonder how many of my stairs are in, uh... Or my... Everything that I need is sitting in a box because it accidentally got caught up in the collection system. You don't want to know the answer to that. I, I most assuredly do not. But why am I worried about jumping around around the outside? I've got the whole. I got the farm turned off. <laughs> uh, I can go in there. I'll take those back. I didn't realize I was turning this into a cod farm. anyway. The water will push everything down around that way. So far so good. I see your farm. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to figure out if I can re reset this to A, use this water to flush slimes a little bit faster, and be able to turn the farm on and off. Because uh, I'm really trying to be respectful of the mob cap, and I don't want to accidentally eat it up when I'm not logged in trying to farm stuff. And... I think I can get this set up so that um, so that I can build a mob farm over this and use this as the collection system for both. The mob grinder I was originally going to build, I can't find the design for. And when I do some rough guesstimates, it's going to take up more of the island than I want it to. Um... The alternative I was looking at is nice, but it requires a lot more materials than I have, so I might have to revisit that one later. Um, which leaves the setup. Although I don't know, I I might I might be able to make something work after all. But either way, I, I'm probably going to build this up so that way the collection system for both is here. 
and I can set up an AFK spot near here and just uh, flick the switch for which farms I want turned on and then go from there. But I need to do a lot more resource gathering. But I don't want to spend my entire stream doing resource gathering, so I'll probably work on that tomorrow. You don't want to go grindy, grindy, grind? Uh, not on stream, no. just work. And it's going to push everybody forward. They'll have the opportunity to jump off to the side. They'll get pushed over sooner or later. Oh, cobblestone. That's right, because I need a cobblestone. start switching to at least using iron more than anything else. I also think if I get really creative, I might be able to get my iron farm into the same collection system. Like, I, I, I am curiously curious in... <laughs> about trying to figure out just how many farms I can get into the same collection system. But I think if I do that, I'm going to want two sets of double chests down there. Which means I would need to rebuild that spot one block higher than it currently is. Oh. And I'm not feeling too good about that. So maybe I will just leave it where it's at. I hear a medic. You do? I'm back. Hello. Hello. How was dinner? It was quick and tasty. Numb. And it sounds like not filled with regret, which is always a good feature to have <laughs> in your dinner. Yes. Yeah. meant for that to be the more scarce one. folly that, 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 that's a very thin ledge right over there <laughs> <laughs> yep so I'm gonna need that there's gonna be one of those guys there so cool when it's three wide. There we go. And we can start working on that in a minute. Come have one of those guys there. And we'll boost the signal again there. Uh, 
sticks? I do not have any sticks. Uh, I have some sticks and a lever. There we go. I just need to get that on a clock. And that when it is off, or when the clock is turned off, that line is unpowered. Yeah. All right. So far, so good. fiery pit of doom. Yeah, like Mo and Curly did earlier. Yeah, I saw that. What happened? Uh, I was replacing my floor with glass and I figured oh, these guys aren't going to be stupid enough to jump down there. And instead they were stupid enough to jump down there and fell to their deaths in lava. Oh, I'm sorry. He, he found out that one. the piglins are stupider than uh, you would think. How did I miscount that? Never mind. Don't answer that. source anyway. Oh. That's the other one. Oh. Huh. I didn't realize I had that. staying. This is the next one that needs to go. Fishes keep falling on my head. <clears throat> Are you wishing for fishing? Mm, actually, you know what? To be honest, that fishing chips we had the last time we were at the beach. Mm -hmm. It's kind of banging. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I could go for that. Could you not? I can always go for fishing chips. Y you just don't know what restraint it took to uh, to not send you a photo of the fish and chips before they arrived. Oh. 
I appreciate that, but I was kind of asleep, so I don't know that. I would have noticed anything. So far as we get, I'll take care of those in a minute. Because what I need to do is I need to raise this side the roof. up. Close. That gets a full block. That gets a full block. The rest of those are going to be slabs. So good. Uh, I think this was the area that I did it the way I'd originally intended and actually put slabs on it. Yeah. Yeah. That's uh, all slapped up like it should be. Slabby jabbied? Mm hmm. water stream going in a minute because I'm going to try to do this smarter and not fight the water as much <laughs> I mean there's a first time for everything right I think beach duck lost internet again I think so All right, you ready for the uh, the latest ethical conundrum? Okay. There was a documentary done on Anthony Bourdain, mm -hmm. and it featured audio of him saying various things that you know the documentary wanted to have him say. Uh, except. There were three selections of his audio that he never vocalized out loud. They used an AI to imitate his voice. I feel like this is about to get real creepy. And the director did not say which parts were actually spoken by him or not. Oh, then why did we choose to have him in the movie say the things? No, no, no. Uh, Anthony Bourdain is dead. I know, but so that's he's not, what I'm saying. Yeah, like, because they are selections of emails and letters that he wrote. So they're things that he said in the sense that he actually wrote them. They are not things that he said in the sense that he never spoke them out loud. I wouldn't speak out loud everything that I wrote. So is it Especially right? Especially not in an email. <laughs> is it right for the documentarian to use the voice recording? Because it was something that he, you know, technically said. No, it's something he wrote, and those are not the same things. But, I mean, they're his words. 
they're his written words. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm I'm a strong like, okay, that's cool, then fine. I'm gonna pick a random selection of any of someone's email and if you think it's that okay, read it out loud on the internet. I mean that that is become that is becoming part of the question that uh, that is being brought up by this. So does this mean that everything you've ever said is now open for uh, open and fair again? Anywhere? Yeah, I feel like that's like a slippery slope to a place that nobody wants to be. Yeah, I, I'm I'm in the same boat. Uh, and then the other question is, is, so what else will this allow us to do with people's voices, with or without their permission? Uh, does this mean that I can contract a, a my voice to be used for a celebrity voice assistant? A and then we can have the AI just, uh, you know, Mimic everything about how I say what I say. You know, so so let's say that you wanted um, a certain Amazon assistant. A uh, <laughs> little, little bit on that in a minute too. Uh, let's say you wanted a, a certain Amazon assistant, and but you wanted it in a celebrity voice. C it, can the celebrity license their voice to be used for that? And, and you know all the fun that comes out of that I just feel like this is getting into a very scary place oh we, we already passed a scary place oh also Amazon has now added Ziggy as a trigger word because Alexa mm -hmm. Alexa was was the 60th most popular name for a female until the release of the Amazon Alexa then it dropped into the 200s. And Amazon's kind of feeling bad about killing a popular name. Shouldn't they maybe feel more bad that people don't want to name their kid after their product, considering a lot of people <laughs> name their kids after weird, nonsensical things these days? Uh, Well, I, I don't know that it's so much not being named after the product as it is being annoyed that every time you say someone's name it turns on a device in the house yes did I not line this up right oh I'm missing a uh... I feel like there's some things in there to be embarrassed about that are not the things that they seem to be feeling bad about. Yeah. Uh, and since Ziggy is, uh... Hang on. What is going on with this water? This is not the way this is supposed to be working. Oh, oh, because I forgot to tear up all the slabs. I don't mean to cut in. Arcadius, how much more black stone are you needing? None. All of it. <laughs> the dragon's done. I don't need any more black stone. Yeah, I was hoping you would say that because I need it. Thank you. <laughs> You're very much welcome. <laughs> Thank you for helping me with the dragon. No problem. Oh, Did and by the way, if you polish. If you polish the uh, black stone, you can turn it into buttons. Mm hmm. Yeah. I mean. But more importantly, did you see that I have a dice dragon? <laughs> I did. Nice. He actually had me warp over to his island just to show me that uh, he has a sign out front that says Race is Rice Dragon. Rice Dragon. Rice Dragon. Rice Dragon. It's a Rice I Dragon. I don't collect the rice, I eat it. Uh, I want to make a. <laughs> A giant wheat field with a bunch of water going through it. And, and call it the horse. race dragon. 
and make a quartz dragon <laughs> the same build style and name it the rice dragon. <laughs> yeah, I, I bought some uh, some of that Uncle Ben's 90 second microwave rice. Mm -mm. I, I, I bought because I needed something quick sometimes and that was quick. Uh, <laughs> So oh, did you I just make another that. right hoe? Mm-hmm. I sure did. Yep. Okay. So you bought indigestion? The jasmine rice is mm -hmm. actually really good. Like, how hungry were you when you made this determination? I feel like no, that no, might no. bear. Was, Fair question. <laughs> no, it, it was really good. Because I'm, I'm going to tell you, there's things that I have regretted, except, uh, you know, when I was really hungry, it, it seemed like a really good idea at the time. There are things that I thought were really good until I had them the second time and went, oh my goodness, what was wrong with me? Nope, and nope. then I look back and go, oh, I was really hungry. Nope, oh, really no, that's good. my shopping trips. That <laughs> and the basmati. Ooh, basmati. Mm -hmm. Does it? How fast does it go zero to? Oh no, Basmati. Basmati is a happy rice. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> For you, any rice is a happy rice. Mm. 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 I don't know who made it. I feel like that's Mr. a fair question. Mm -hmm. Mr. Boz? Mr. Boz Marty, please report to the office. Mr. Where did all my uh, missing stone styles go? Besides the way where everything goes. Did they get... They probably got caught up in there. Okay. I can't tell how high up I am, but I think I'm pretty high up. Why don't you turn on the coordinate hood? Meh. Meh? That takes work and has things and... It's just a lot. Has things. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Now that's working right. I'm not interested in extra right now. Well, there's a lot of extra to be had right now. Actually, if that's two blocks up, that means the slimes can't jump on it anyway. So it should be slimes safe. Slimes got no hops? Uh, not a two block hop. They got plenty of hops. Yeah. Just not two blocks worth. The three wide portion of my stair is several platforms tall. Mm -hmm. I like several platforms. I still feel like I want to do it's something. It's a new else. standardized unit of measurement. <laughs> so it is. <laughs> Make it so. this where it is so I got a path to walk on and build it's slabbed up so nothing will spawn there I'll neaten that up a little bit I just want to let's do that yeah Can't ever tell if you're trying to say no one go to bed or no one said go to bed. Said no one go to bed. All right, let's not walk off off the ledge here. The 
still got a long ways to go, though. Mr. Mending actually almost got outside on me. I still need to find a way to cover up that redstone a little bit. But that's not going to happen right now. Uh, well, actually, you know what? I bet I could run the redstone... Now I'm wondering if I could run the redstone along the back. Ah, let's try that. It's only 8.30. Let me go get a couple more pickaxes before I do. Yeah. Hear you, hungry puppy. <laughs> Somebody's being special. Er? Yeah. Yeah, special er. It's the Java. Mm hmm. He's very good at special. Uh, he is very good at special. You could say it's his specialty. Actually hurt. <laughs> oh come on! It wasn't that bad. I could not. Hmm. 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 Okay. about this, shall we? Good, but where's the fun in that? Uh, the fun is not falling into the void and losing more stuff again. So, Anon, have you started building your new character for the next campaign? No, I have not. I'm having a hard enough time keeping track of my character this campaign. Fair enough. Does Arcadius and Medic care to share their latest and greatest plans? Mm, no. Okay. Clean up more about the back later. 
that at least gets me that far. That also keeps things from spawning and jumping me while I try to wire this up. Focus is real when you're standing at the edge of the void. I certainly hope it is. Of any time for focus, that would probably be it. Shall we? Yeah. Sounds like a puppy's being fed. Yeah, that's because a puppy's being fed. Vigorously? No, he's eating vigorously. I don't know if that's the same as him being fed vigorously. Hmm. He always eats vigorously. Mm-hmm. that this actually still works like it should. spawning platforms again. And then I'll go step away for a little bit. Oh, I'll grab my slabs and my cob. And spawn there, but oh, I guess it's because he was at the edge. Okay. Oh, because they're far enough away that they are still randomly despawning. I went just a little too far away. Oh. Well, that's not good. Okay. All the wall. All the wall needs to get elevated now. Because I brought that up a block. Okay, let me go get some cobble, andesite, 
and stone. And maybe get a little bit lower <laughs> elevation so a phantom doesn't come screaming out of the night. Before I go too far. Yeah, I need to... Where is the sleepy happening? Will that push those guys? Well, nobody was on the platform in the first place, so... I'll never know. Yeah, that at least turns off the platform. You know what? For only... For only two... For one stem, that, that that's better than I would have thought. At least for now. I'll have a better system set up before too long. Alright, so we'll let those guys do their thing. What's the sure I mean cane one called? Uh uh sugar farmer. The first one is Sugar Planter, and then it's followed by Sugar Farmer, which is the repeatable one. Oh, sweet. Literally. I got dirt. On who? I got dirt, period. <laughs> I mean... It's a valid question. Meh. Meh? What do you mean, meh? Meh. Meh. You have dirt on meh? Me. Meh. I mean, I knew he was a sketch dragon and all, but... He was not sketch. <laughs> meh. Good sir. <laughs> oh, Jubba, she's not mad at you. <laughs> He's slinking away. <laughs> meh was not sketch. Thank you very much. He hung out with a very sketch group. That's not his fault. <laughs> I mean, is it? No. No? He was raised in that environment. He didn't have any choices. Uh-huh. So you're saying that there's no choice? Ooh. I'm saying that sometimes you're given the group that you associate with. Mm -hmm. And you you can't do it from multiple ones, can you? What? What do you mean? The boxes. What about the boxes? You can't make it do multiple. Yeah, one on each side. But I only have them as single boxes. Yeah, so one on the front, one on the left side, one on the right side, one on the back. Oh. What did I come up here for? Oh, andesite. Uh, I guess some more here, right? I didn't realize I hadn't done that one yet. Really? Congratulations. Thank you. Do I need any more pressure plates? No, I don't need any more pressure plates. Where's my spruce box? I'm done with the trap doors. I'm done with the pressure plates. I'm gonna hang on to the slabs for the moment. I'm done with the dark oak trap doors. Oh, I opened up some other ones. Mm-hmm. That's how that goes. Mm -hmm. right. Mm 
You're supposed to get the carrot from the bad guys, right? Uh, you can get the carrot from player kill on zombies. Although it's a stupidly small percentage. So, how do you like your chances? Uh, you can also get it from one of the challenges. I just forget which one. No, <gasps> I has diamonds. Uh, you get a carrot from completing the potato farmer challenge. And you get a potato from one of the other ones. Which one gave you the stupid potato? Oh. Oh, that's just wrong. The carrot farmer gives you a potato. The potato farmer gives you a carrot. Mm-hmm. But look, 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 look. That's... So I'm harvesting wheat, I put it away, and I have my wheat farmer. Mm-hmm. I didn't... I didn't realize that it did you that dirty like that. <sighs> All right. One more problem to fix. That's okay. What's one more problem to fix? Thank you! You're welcome. For one more problem did to fix. Did you only drop a carrot and a potato? No, I did not. And yet I have them. I'm curious about this water fixture that Arcadius has going off the edge of his island. You don't want to know? I probably don't. Okay. Is this his best of river runs through it? There are some things I just don't want to know. Oh. Oh, and a carrot. Where is everyone else? Uh, I am focusing on not falling into the void again. That seems like a very good thing to focus on. I'm in the nether. Also seems like a good thing to focus. Otherwise, I would have talked about uh, <laughs> Troy Hunt and Scott Helm uh, contemplating what they could do about spammers. Because Troy runs a website, uh, he gets a lot of those professional development type spam where, where it's, you know, we would like to help you grow your website by providing guest blog posts and that kind of junk. And so he decided, he, he and uh, Scott were talking about, like, what, 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 do we, what do we do about these guys? Oh, oh, I know. Let's make an increasingly crazy set of criteria for them to go through. Like, we'd love to have your guest blog posts. But we need the senior executive to sign off on it. So if you go to this form on the website and fill it out, then we can start moving forward with the authorization process to get uh, to get the, the guest blog post approved. And then just like keep ramping up the crazy on what they need to do for the next step and the next step. That is both dirty and beautiful. I, I kind of figured you would like that one. I have been known to appreciate a good a good hustle a turn at humor no, I mean and the idea the, the main idea that they were trying to get at is uh, trying to get them to expend resources without themselves expending resources because Troy does those videos where he runs some of the telemarketers through various shenanigans and he likes them you know he finds them fun but they they are at the end of the day, the, the time he's spending doing that is time he's not spending working on various projects.
and uh, he would like to waste their time to make it less worth going through the hassle of trying to wasting other people's yeah some more uh, stone fence. It is raining. It's a good time to go fishing if I had a fishing pole. Yeah, I don't have one of those either, but I don't ever like doing that, regardless. Um, I don't like doing it, but I like the things you get from doing it. So Obviously, you haven't fished in this yet. <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, Obviously, Anon hasn't fished in this yet. Uh, it, it's not so much the... Ch I know the changes in fishing really jack the loot tables, and uh, it's not so much that as it, as it is... I know in order to do a fair number of the challenges, I'm going to have to do some fishing, even though I don't like fishing. Although, yeah, well, I'm, 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 contemplate I'm contemplating what... Uh, what farms I could do. Wait, why am I doing all this in stone? I meant to do this in lumber anyway. <sighs> For serious. Have you fished much, Medic? Uh, yes. <laughs> you said that like it was kind of a duh thing. Uh, because, because of his problems with, uh, the loot tables that have changed. Oh no, no! I mean, I guess you could put it that way. I wasn't even getting fishing rods. You're supposed to get fishing rods from using your fishing rod. Yeah. Yeah, you're supposed to get fishing rods from fishing. How much yeah. do you think I've ever fished in this game? It's a percentage chance, like everything else. It just depends on uh, on your luck. Yeah, I was having to use a very, very, very limited supply of wool or a string to constantly build new fishing poles. And I just couldn't afford it no more. So I gave up on fishing. Yeah, he I couldn't afford his fishing habit. Out of it. <laughs> I mean, I wasn't getting anything out of it. I, I didn't get a single enchanted thing at all. Wow. Is that how it's supposed to work? Um... It's not supposed... Well, okay. Yes, you are supposed to get enchanted things from fishing, but it's supposed to be ridiculously hard. Like, it was... Astonishingly... Well, it sounds like someone met their goal. It was astonishingly too easy before. And so the objective was to get it to the percentages that they were originally trying to achieve. I've gotten a magic fishing pole twice. I've gotten several bows. I've gotten a book. Two books. One, two. Anyway. So, as far as I'm concerned, the fishing loot table is just fine. <laughs> as I said, <laughs> I got absolutely nothing but oh, boots. <laughs> I'm trying to engage the elytra I don't have yet. I did that <laughs> today. Yeah, he did. Earlier. That's why he's got that one by his name. Oh, yeah. I, I didn't realize that it only started counting when I... I, I thought it was going to count the previous ones. I was trying to get the island level up there. But it turns out that you need an extra plug-in to connect the different pieces. And I'm so tired of the answer to your problem being, I'm sorry, your solution is in another plug-in. Like, that is getting very irksome. Holy smokes. What? What? I need to build something 
Mm -hmm. with 512 sandstone, 64 chiseled sandstone, 128 smooth sandstone. Well, uh, don't forget, chiseled sandstone, you can get off of the the, uh, stone cutter uh, once you get the sandstone. I guess you need to get a uh, killer cactus farm going (laughs) to get all that sand, though. And that only gives you three of the 12 in portal frames you're going to need. Mm-hmm. Do the exact same thing in quartz to get another three of them. Mm-hmm. Well, at least you can get massive amounts of quartz from uh, Piglin Trading. So get well, to making get some... lots of quartz from my mason. I mean, I'm not worried about the quartz part. Get, it's the get, sandstone that's Get like, to making some what? friends with the piggies. And... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I hate that I cooked all that stone and now it's going to get reduced to cobble because I am very absent minded hush I don't want to hear it I said nothing mm-hmm. I heard it I heard it I literally said nothing mm-hmm I heard you nothing. (laughs) Once more over the void, dear friend. Once more over the void. can't even pick up the stuff if it falls off the edge over past my island. What's that one that you're playing with called? Hmm? Is there polished sandstone? No, polished stone. Which one? Smooth stone. This stuff? I'm trying to think of it. The stuff that the actual spawning platform is made out of? Yeah. That is smooth stone. You get it from baking regular stone, which you get from baking your cobblestone. So I need your choice baked stone. But it can't be okay. half-baked. Well, I've had some plans that were half-baked. That's almost the same. head around the corner like that's going to help me see. <laughs> you don't know how many times I've... What, done that very thing? Yes. Especially in like a shooter or something. Oh, yeah. I'll try and look around the corner. It's like, that's not helping. <laughs> Maybe I just need to get a VR headset or something. Well, there's a lot of companies working on that. I don't know how good it's going to be, but... uh... What, a VR headset, or are you talking about, like, the deep dive system that they're looking into? Which deep dive system are you talking about? Uh, There's a Japanese company. I don't know the name off the top of my head. (coughs) But they've got a system that they're nicknaming Nerve Gear, even though the owners of that name are an anime and they're kind of being a little testy about it. Oh, wow. <laughs> I mean, once you start talking intellectual property, a lot of people get more special than they have any right to be. I don't know. I, I would figure you'd be like, hey, yeah, we're... Uh... Yeah, yeah. You, you, you tell that to uh, a certain entertainment company with a, a given uh, mouse-like mascot. 
Yeah, we're not talking about them. We don't talk about them ever. They're not allowed in this house. Um. <laughs> Yeah, but anyway, it, it's supposed to be a... Alright, let's see if I can finish this correctly. Oh no, I use polished andesite for the outside, okay. <clears throat> oh, I was trying to figure out what you are over here looking for. That's probably not the best place to stop and pause. Did you just... Okay, you... you <laughs> wow. It looked like you were just standing there and then all of a sudden you disappeared off my screen. Because as you walked out of my render distance. I didn't walk out of your render distance. I teleported home. Oh, okay. Oh, medic, I'm sorry. Oh. That's a sadness. That is a sadness. Yeah, I originally wanted to get Island. Oh, argh, duck on it. <laughs> Does anyone have any extra andesite they don't need? Anyone that's playing the share game? I wonder who that leaves out. <laughs> I have some andesite that you can uh, barter with, or barter for. What do I have that you want? Right now, the main things I need is uh, glass, black stone, and emeralds. But, um, in order for me to get emeralds, I could always use paper. Uh, bad guy skin. Um, the skin of your enemies. Oh, yes, nothing fell in the lava. Oh. Wow, rats. That, I that... literally died right at the corner of this <laughs> base, and nothing fell in the lava. That Dude. is very fortunate. Yes. You don't even need redstone, do you? Uh, you know what? Let me go see if one of my guys actually takes redstone for a trade, which I don't think he No, does. nobody buys redstone, but clerics will sell it. Yeah, I don't, I don't need it. Okay. And what's the thing that makes paper again? Sugar cane. Sugar, or sugar cane. Oh, I got lots of that. I'll take it. And you said andesite, right? Yep. Uh, I'll do a one for one. So, how much, how much sugar cane can you do? Mm, let's see, because I just did a bunch of quests with it, but I can farm more up for future. Yeah, I let this thing overgrow all the time because it produces a lot. Which one? Uh, right now I have a stack of sugar cane. Oh. Okay, I'll bring you a stack of andesite. Uh, well, I'll bring you a stack of andesite for the sugar cane. Uh, what about bad guy skin? Mm, I hope I don't have much of that. Are you looking I don't have any reason for it, to have much or are you trying yet? to get rid of it? No, that's what I can use to get emeralds from my cleric. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Um... I have two bad, bad guy skins. No. Let me go see. What else? Uh, sugar cane. Uh... I have lapis. I have a ton of black ink and ink sacks. Oh my goodness. Oh, you know what? The black <laughs> ink or the uh, ink sacks I can sell. Oh, okay, cool. Who buys the ink sacks? Yep. Uh, I have two of my uh, my people or my book guys that buy them, the librarians. 
Really? I forgot the librarians did that. Huh. Yep, in that one... How how many stacks of that do you have? Uh, I have just shy of a stack and a half, a uh, stack and 29. Right, for that Ooh. stack and 29, I'll give you another stack and a site. Sweet. I see you're stacking already. Never mind, apparently I have one, two... <laughs> Uh, I have one, two, three, four stacks and 29. Okay, then I'll give you three stacks of Amosite for it. Sweet. And 36. Three stacks and 36 of Amosite. Awesome. Flash. No, uh... no, 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 no. 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 Let me come to you first. Okay. So I'm going to drop off the end of sight because you can't pick it up on my island. Uh, let's see. Boop. 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 And boop. Is that necessary Sweet. for trading with Rayust? To say the yes. boops? Yes. Yeah. Slash IS space warp space yep. <laughs> X. Meh. I, dick. I'm going to figure out how to alias or... slash warp Ray asked to boop. That's what I need to do. <laughs> Just type in slash boop. Yep. I, I need to figure out a way to alias it so that way slash boop will take you to Ray Est's island. Boop. And boop. Thank, Thank you. you. feel like you hate on the boops. He does. Maybe. What did the boops do to you? Well, I mean, I've been having enough coffee that I really need to, you know. Go boop. <laughs> <laughs> mm. That's not the good kind of boop. <laughs> Nobody mm. wants those boops. Ooh, that's almost all of it that I need to start. That's super exciting. Ah. Uh, okay, now let's go do very dangerous things. <clears throat> the way that you say that. <laughs> My vines have grown. I think they're going to go all the way to the bottom. I, I was wondering about that. Okay, all of that that you brought me got me mm -hmm. three and a half stacks of glass. Sweet. With, a, with 11 emeralds left over. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. That's really funny because I ended up with about three and a half stacks of the finished product that I was trying to end up with. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. These stairs are a lot comfier when they're three wide. Uh, yeah. By the way, the guy that the guy that I watch a lot of playing uh, Phasmophobia, mm -hmm. he boops mm -hmm. too. See, booping is important. It is a very important part of your health. Mm -hmm. Oh, now I remember why I use this. What? Because you already bordered your island with the other stuff, and I didn't want us to use the same stuff. Ah. Yeah, I almost went through and bordered mine and polished diorite. I... 
Yeah, I, I don't have the, I don't get some of the hate for it. It's not that bad. No, it's not. The, the polished isn't. The regular diorite looks like crap. Looks like but, it does look like bird poop. But you know, the polished diorite, I don't mind. and begin I am so tired of gas I got two of them right now oh <laughs> I thought you said gas and I was like well I mean yeah I can see where that would be a problem no I'm trying to I'm trying to head down to uh, build me a safer way of getting down to the lava level and dang on gas. I wonder if they're spawning over somebody else's island, and that's the real problem. Because there's probably another island over there for me that I haven't gotten to yet, and there's another island for Reyes that she hasn't gotten to yet. Now, one of them, one of them spawned towards Arcadius's island. The other one literally spawned under where I'm standing. They are irritating sometimes. But what's really cool is with all, the whole glass thing, they get right up on the glass. So it's like they just kind of hover right over you sometimes. That's <laughs> not creepy at all. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Okay. So that works. Now I just need to figure out what timing I want for the clock that'll push them off. That'll work. So I raised the wall because I raised part of the platform. Uh, I've now got it set up so that way there is a way to flush the slimes off the platforms. I'm hoping that means I can get them into that water stream and dying quicker. It also means that I can leave, uh, I can leave that water flowing and that turns the farm off because the slimes won't spawn where there's water. Uh, I law, I think I got a net loss in some of the uh, spawning platform space though. But it might be okay. That might be okay. One of these days I'll get dispensers, but uh, water log trap doors work just fine. All right. Uh, I'm in sleep, please. Not in. I don't have a bed. Arcadius. Nah. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, I need to scrounge up enough iron for three, four, five more hoppers. I'll get five more campfires, and then I'll get that spot set up. I might, I might rearrange it though, so that way that gets raised up one block, and I can have two tiers of storage, which means I'll need five, uh, three, five, eight more hoppers. But the flip side of that is I think this is where I'm going to build a mob dropper. Um, I just need to build it above Y40 so that way uh, so that way slimes don't spawn in the mob dropper. But I'll try to have it set up so that way I can turn these on and off independently. And I guess this means that I can't rely on fall damage to kill these guys. 
Unless I can find a way to get a drop chute going that the spiders can't climb back up. I'll have to look into what spiders can and can't climb up and figure out how, how I might be able to rig a drop chute that they'll fall down and not, uh, and not cause problems. Yeah. But that'll have to be next time. I'm going to need more resources to build that anyway. I don't... You've seen what I got. I got almost nothing. <laughs> I need to... I need to spend a lot more time with the cobble generator. And, uh... It's hard to do that when you got just the stone tools, because those run out really quick. But it is what it is. That produces a lot of slime, though. Good. I might, uh, I might do some uh, flying machine-based farms since I got a productive enough slime farm for it. All right, all that's going in there. We can toss those in there for now. Maybe not. And then I think I'll need to start planning storage. I, I think what I want to do is I want to make uh, this central area. Like, this ladder is at the center of where the original island spawned. So, this ladder is the exact center of the island. I think I want to turn this central area into a storage and workroom. And then start building out a little bit more from there. I just don't know how big I want to set up the storage area. Especially since uh, it's a lot of manual sorting. Because we're limited on the number of hoppers. Yeah, I'm to the point now where it tells me that I can't place a hopper until it actually checks to make sure I'm allowed to place a hopper. Mm. But well, something tells me that you have more hoppers than me. Um, <sighs> no, that's it's not island info that I wanted. What is it? Island. have 10 hoppers. Level? Nope, that's not what I wanted. What was the command that actually shows that? There is a... I, I'm trying to learn all the commands and I... Memory. Yeah, I got 8 hoppers right now. I'm about to put a lot more into that farm, but since I, I don't feel as bad since it's going to be for multiple things. I feel less bad about using that many hoppers when it goes to uh, many things. Yeah, the worst thing, I, I, I've got two hoppers that I'm using for a uh, automatic um, bone meal farm. Which I absolutely do not need <laughs> at all. Uh, I will pro if I as long as I can square away the space. You know, depending on how things go, I may I may actually go ahead and do something like that and have an automatic bone meal farm. Just because it it is one of those things that I, I'm going to want to. Uh, dispense uh with, with uh extra crops once once i get uh crops farms going that'll you know have extra crops now I'm, I'm seriously just going to put a hole uh in the floor of my nether place and when i got a load of a bunch of stuff like this poppies mm -hmm. i'm just going to go there and then dump them by the handfuls 
into the hole, which yeah. will dump it into the lava. That's more manual work than I'm willing to do. Automate. Automate, automate. I, I will, however, probably set up a trash chute somewhere on the island that drops everything into the void. So everywhere that I build one of these floors, there'll be a dispenser... Uh, a smart dispenser that whatever you load in there will will uh, get dispensed into the void. But uh, that, that's for when I get more resources than I know what to do with. Which is not today. No, that is not today. I keep feeling like there was something else I probably ought to get done before I finish finish. Oh. Ask Arcadius about the weird water stream? You're building a polished andesite pillar at the corners? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to have a polished andesite cube. Okay. Are you going to build a wall between the islands? No, but I needed to know how far out was my corner. Yeah. At the top. <laughs> and I knew how far it was on the bottom. You're not just going to keep uh, placing blocks until it tells you you can't? Uh, no, the last time I did that, I died. Thank you very much. Well, yeah, because you put the block, walked over it, and then it disappeared because you weren't supposed to be able to put a block there. But well, you don't walk on the block until it stays. Mm, no, I just apparently died. It was a thing. Oh, I forgot I had those four gold nuggets cooking. That's so I can make a gold pickaxe when I get to the nether. Yeah, Arcadius <laughs> didn't believe me that you said that. What? That uh, the gold pickaxe is the uh, best one to use in yeah. the nether. Yeah, it's only slightly better than netherite. He couldn't understand why I put mending on my gold pickaxe. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, to, to to be honest, once I get a netherite pick, I will probably use it because even though it is less efficient, it is more durable. A and I, I will appreciate the time spent more efficiently. Uh I put mending on that gold pickaxe, and just the the quartz alone keeps it topped off. Yeah, well, I guess between mending and maybe unbreaking, you could probably make a lot of stuff happen that way. Well, it does have unbreaking three on it also, and efficiency four, I believe. Sorry, I'm distracted by Jeva staring intently at the wall. I can't figure That's out what's going <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. That puppy sometimes. Change. All right. Uh, I will probably call it here so I can figure out why the puppy is staring at the wall. Uh, he probably needs to do something now. And uh, and then I get the live stream uploaded and maybe, maybe get my act together so I can get more resources so I can do more building on stream and off. Because uh, I'm falling behind. Although, I also need to get the permissions thing figured out. I've got... Uh, I posted another uh, follow-up message with uh, the guy who runs the Block project. Just to see if there's any extra configuration or if I just need to install the LuckPerms permission extension. And, uh, and everything should work from there. I'm going to go since only three of the available biomes to switch to are in quests, I'm going to go put the rest of them under appropriate quests and then backlog permissions for whoever actually completed them. Uh, I've got somewhere in my notes an admin command that lets me view the challenge list as, the, as if I were the person that I'm checking on. So I'll be able to see who completed what and... Uh, and then assign permissions out that way. Uh, and then go from there. Although I don't think I'll I don't think I'll set up the the sky. Uh, maybe I will. 
I'm not sure what that'll do. I'm not familiar with the sky biome <laughs> and what it'll do. Uh, oh, and... Didn't we start there? No. We started in an ocean biome. That ocean biome was a little island the in the sky. It didn't feel like oceans. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, by the way, uh, Medic, I remember yes. you asking when we were talking about it why somebody would possibly want to set a biome to the desert. And I forgot that in the desert, your mob spawners will give you more skeletons and creepers and spiders than zombies. So if you want less zombies in your mob spawner, you'll want to set the biome to desert. That is why somebody might want that. Okay. All right. Let me get to the credit screen and prepare to... Uh, Do the usual outro, 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 etc. <laughs> Live Tuesdays at 6.30 p.m. U.S. Eastern Fridays as Games Revisited. Uh, it should be back. Last Friday, I, wa I wasn't I was just exhausted. I was beyond exhausted. Uh, you, can, you can see it in the live stream that got cut off by the power outage. Uh, yeah, that, that was not a good day to be doing Games Revisited. So far, this week is looking a little bit better, and I intend to work to keep it that way. So that way I can get the next uh, the next six episodes of the Zelda series going. Because I, I, I am enjoying this little retrospective on uh, A Link to the Past. Uh, those episodes and these live streams and hopefully more will go up on the YouTube channel. There's a link down below unless you're already watching this at some later point in time. Uh, in which case, uh, you should probably subscribe if you haven't already. And that way you'll... you'll uh, see it in your subscriptions feed you can even hit the bell icon if you want the notifications uh follow on twitch that way you get notified when i go live and uh let's uh let's see who's available for a raid Ooh, decisions grimly night attack or beast lord i think i'm gonna go with beast lord because he is a good man uh, if you haven't already, do give him a follow when you get over there. So I'm going to hit the title card. I'm going to start the raid. Stick around for it, and I will see you later. <laughs>